Hey guys, welcome to another story of a Nanny Story Saturdays. Today I'm bringing you, yes, another story that involves poop slash pee. So stay tuned for this weird, fetishy, maybe story on how my kid wanted me to sit in the bathroom with him while he pooped and peed. Like what? All right, so I had just started working with this uh, toddler of three. He was a boy and he had attachment issues. He was an only child and attachment issues may be a little bit strong, but he honestly would not do anything without you doing it with him. He had a really, really small sense of what it meant to play independently. And I honestly think it was because he was an only child. That was a big factor. And because his parents also wanted to be a part of his every move, which is fine, but to a certain extent, because if not, you're going to hinder him from being independent. Like it would be to the point where in the house, if he wanted to go from the living room to the kitchen, they would carry him and walk him you know, 10, 15 steps. And he would ask for it and they would be like, yeah, sure. And then they wondered why, you know, teachers and, you know, doctors were telling him that he needs to develop his muscular and core strength. But anyways, all right. So here's the story. So I started working with them and um, it was a little bit funny at first, a little weird because he would tell me, Joanne, I need to go poop. And I'd be like, okay, well, there's the bathroom. I'll be right out here. Let me know if you need me to help you wipe. I'll help you wipe. And then he'd, he'd get upset. He'd be like, no, I want you to come to the bathroom with me. Come watch me poop. Come watch you what? Come watch you poop. Um, No, this is your private time. I will not watch you poop. Go to the bathroom and let me know when you're done. So it became like a big ordeal. And then um, I asked the mom, I'm like, hey, he's asking me to watch him poop. Like, what's what's going on? And they're like, ah, oh, yeah, you know, we watch him poop. He likes when somebody sits in the bathroom with him. Uh, and then he interrupts and he, he's like, yeah, and I watch mommy and daddy go to the bathroom, too. I was like, um, OK, so there's no sense of privacy in this house. I can tell because that's like an extremely private moment, like. I don't want anybody watching me poo. Like, what? It's just weird. Plus, like, poo smells. You know, you may pass gas. Like, that's embarrassing for an adult, at least. For a child of three, he doesn't care what he does. They, they pass gas. They don't even say, excuse me. They say, ew, that stinks, and they start laughing. But I wasn't having that. So um, he told his mom, oh, Joanne doesn't watch me poop. And then she's like, well, sweetheart, you know, sometimes people don't want to watch other people poop. It's, and it's okay. You, you can do it by yourself. And he was like, he looked at her like she had three heads. Like, what? People don't watch people poop, but you watch me poop and I watch you poop. So why can't she watch me poop? Um, because that's not how we do things in real life. Maybe in your little bubble, but Nanny Joanne doesn't watch other kids poop. I'm really sorry. I'll help you clean, but I will not watch you poop. I will not sit there while you poop. Definitely not doing it. I'm so sorry. I'm, I'm not doing that. So um, I guess she grew concerned because if we would be in public places, she would, um, before we went, she'd be like, oh, if he needs to go to the bathroom, can you just make sure to go in there with you? And I told her, I'm like, listen, I will never leave your son in a public bathroom by himself. However, I'm not going to go in the stall with him. Is that what you expect? expect me to do because I'm not doing that. I'll stand right outside the door like a lot of parents do and nannies, but I'm not going in the stall with him. I can line up the the seat, but I'm not watching him poop. Like, I'm sorry. Like, is that weird? Like, please let me know in the comments. Like, would you sit there and actively watch your child or the child that you watch poop? Like, is that something that you do or am I just like a mean nanny? Just please let me know in the comments below. But, um, you know, kids are really smart. 
with me, they're with one, they're, they, they act one way. And with mom and dad, they act a whole nother way. So at the end of the day, by the time he got to know me and I got to know him, I was not, and I never watched him poop. I might have stood by the doorway at first, but after that, I was like, I'm not, mm -mm, sorry, this is, this is just not for me. I'm not doing this. But um, he figured it out, and then I'd be in the kitchen or, you know, outside the bathroom door, and he'd be like, Joanne, I'm done. So I'd go in there, make sure that he got everything out, you know, spread the cheeks. Okay, everything's good. All right, flush. But um, no, like, that's kind of weird. Like, honestly, like, first of all, if you're on the potty in the toilet, that's your private time, number one. Number two, um, it stinks, you know, like, nobody's poop smells like roses you know it's it it stinks and if your poop doesn't stink then pfft, let me know what kind of diet you have no just kidding sometimes my poop doesn't stink tmi but whatever but no yeah sometimes poop tends to stink you know at the end of the day it's been food that's digested it passes through your intestines and it's probably been in your body for like at least a day or two sometimes longer depending on how constipated you are and he was like on really high fat diet because he was like super skinny. So yeah, it stunk. Um, number three, like I don't want him, I don't want to be the reason why he develops any weird odd fetishes. Like what if he gets older and he wants women to watch him poop and he gets like off of that because, you know, I don't know. I know I'm going like extremely, you know, right, but hey. Things happen. People do like some weird things because from when they were children, they thought it was okay. But let me tell you, watching another kid poop for many reasons, not okay, not in my book. It's your private time, okay? Guys, thanks for watching this nanny stories of yet again, another poop bathroom related video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. And if you can relate, please, Give me a thumbs up and let me know in the comment section below. Am I a mean nanny or it's just, just, you know, or am I right? Like, it's your private time. Like, no, I'm sorry. You're not going to fall in the toilet. I promise. I promise you won't fall in the toilet. And if you fall in the toilet, it's okay. We, there's a shower right there. Hey, it works out. All right, guys. Like I said, thanks for watching. Make sure you're subscribed and stay tuned for more Nanny's Stories Saturdays from yours truly, Nanny Joanne. Bye.